Meta boss Mark Zuckerberg says he regrets bowing to what he called pressure from the White House to censor content in Facebook and Instagram. Yeah, Zuckerberg vowing to the House Judiciary Committee to resist any potential federal efforts to influence Meta's content moving forward. ABC's M. Wen has the latest from Washington. Today, Meta CEO Mark Zuckerberg saying he regrets not being more outspoken about what he called pressure from the Biden administration to censor content. The Facebook founder claiming the White House repeatedly pushed for the company to censor posts related to COVID-19 during the pandemic, saying administration officials expressed a lot of frustration when the tech giant resisted. Zuckerberg in a letter to the House Judiciary Committee saying, I believe the government pressure was wrong, adding I feel strongly that we should not compromise our content standards and we're ready to push back if something like this happens again. The administration had stressed efforts to target misinformation online. President Biden asked about this the summer of 2021. On COVID misinformation, what's your message to platforms like Facebook? They're killing people. I mean, it really, they really, look, the only pandemic we have is among the unvaccinated. And, that, and, they're, and they're killing people. Biden later insisted he wasn't talking about Facebook specifically. The White House responding, our position has been clear. We believe tech companies should take into account the effects their actions have on the American people while making independent choices. The Republican-led House Judiciary Committee celebrated Zuckerberg's letter today as a win for free speech. This comes as officials warn this year's election could be inundated with misinformation on social media. M. Wynn, ABC News, Washington.